You're right guys, it's Capgun Tom here and welcome to another FIFA News Flash and it is time for Team of the Week. It's Team of the Week number 19. There's some decent looking players in there as well as another PSG player to add to our checklist. Oh, when will it end? I don't know. But anyway, if you're looking to buy some Ultimate Team Coins, go check out futcoinking.com. Their link will be down in the description. Use Cap5 at checkout for a discount. Also, they're running a giveaway on their Twitter right now. I will do a link to the tweet. It will be on the top line. Click it, follow the instructions, and you can be entered into a 100k giveaway. And they're going to be doing giveaways every day this week, I think. So make sure that you follow them while you're there. So let's have a look at this team of the week then. We have up front the guy that we all expected to see there, Etta. So got that hat-trick against Man United to my dismay and uh, you can see there he has 91 pace, 88 dribbling, 86 shooting, 70 passing and 76 heading. We have a second in form, Adebayor, 75 pace, 84 shooting, 82 dribbling and 86 heading for him. We also have an in form, Matri, I don't see this one going for much though, he has 80 pace, um, 77 shooting and 81 heading. Moving into the midfield, you can see that PSG player, it is Verratti, which is a shame because I would have preferred Motta to get an inform because I prefer playing Motta but obviously that's neither here nor there and Verratti will fit into my team quite nicely so his first inform hopefully it'll go for discard he has 83 passing and 83 dribbling as well as 73 defending then we also have an inform Vidal this card's going to go for absolutely tons I reckon 80 pace 81 shooting 85 passing 84 dribbling 83 defending and 72 heading he's an absolute monster I can see him going for a lot of coins we then have an inform or second in form, Kabai, 84 rating overall with 82 dribbling and 86 passing as well as 83 shooting and he's got a heck of a free kick on him so another one that might be worth picking up for your BPL squad then we have Santi Cathola now they've put him out at left mid which is a shame because he would have been worth a heck of a lot more at Cam there's a lot of very good left midfielders already in the BPL I mean we've got Nasri out on the left mid as an in form we have uh, the likes of Hazard we have a whole bunch of like cheap budget players so him there isn't the best of news I think that a cam version of him would be so much better but you can see that he's still got very nice stats 79 pace 81 shooting 87 passing and 88 dribbling moving on to the defense we have a couple of league one players first one is Badimo from Leon and he has 82 pace and 79 defending defending as well as 77 passing and 75 heading we then have Ricardo Cavallo from AS Monaco he's only got 51 pace but he does have 82 defending and 81 heading so those aren't too bad stats we also have Jean Matt another player from the air division is he here and uh, he has 74 pace as well as 77 passing 74 dribbling 76 defending and 70 heading in goal we have Navas and uh, he plays for Levante he has 84 diving and 80 reflexes which is kind of crazy for only a 73 silver rated goalkeeper moving on to the bench we can see that we have two more silver players you have Javito first who looks like an all right player but uh, you know I can't see him going for all that much we have Lafondra who has uh, 77 pace, 70 dribbling and 76 shooting. He will go for an absolute ton, plays for Reading and I just think that he will be a very, very expensive player. Moving on to the bronzes, we have Kahlili and uh, he's a Swedish player and, uh, you know, he's got all right stats but he doesn't have anything that stands out. Maybe he's shooting at 7-3 overall. We have Veselinovic who only has 43 pace who I can't see for going for that much because um, just generally too slow and uh, but he does have 75 heading so maybe that saves him. We have Kiss as well and uh, he looks all right with you know 67 defending and 67 heading maybe one to play as a center defensive mid we also have Tavernier who's a 72 pace right back he has uh, 67 defending and 61 heading as well as 64 passing and finally we have Belowski from Notts County the Polish goalkeeper has 72 diving he also has 69 reflex 66 handling 61 kicking and 65 positioning maybe one of the more expensive bronzes in this team of the week so there you go guys hope you've enjoyed it make sure you go and check out that FUT coin king giveaway that I mentioned at the start. Like the video if you've enjoyed, subscribe if you're new to the channel and I will see you all next time.